Hey, what's up guys? This is Raph Five. This is my half anime in Milwaukee. You can see I got I got some pretty good stuff. There's just some other stuff I got, but I'm not gonna show those yet. I'm just gonna start with the, you know some small stuff or not small. Well, these are, no, these are not small. These are awesome stuff. I'm excited to get these stuff. First thing, okay, I uh, picked up some manga, Starship Hunters, because I've been meaning to get some new manga at least, and I saw this. This was on sale. Well, it's not new manga, you can say, because it does look pretty old. But you know, Starship Hunters, I, I like the series, so I might as well check out the manga, right? I picked up this, uh, one of the first things I picked up was this Esther Ho Zihima. She's from Zihima. The line is called. Sal Moving System. Right, okay, that's pretty cool. She has some unique articulation. She like you know she has a good articulation, and all that. I you know I always like getting a toy line, uh, so toy line there heard of, and would has good art. You know, I was like oh this articulation looks really nice. She has double jointed elbows. I think you can see good jointed knees, but it, you know more like a double jointed knees. She has a lot. She has tons of articulation. It's pretty cool. She comes with two pairs of hands and one uh, extra hand to hold the um, this broomstick. A push broom or something like that. And that's part of her skirt and an extra head. So I guess I have to get like another character to so, you know that has swapped out the heads. <laughs> but we're pretty cool. She also comes with a base. I got this on Sunday at the convention I'm in Milwaukee. Uh, this Yugi Nagito prize figurine. It was a pretty good price. She's one of my one of my favorite characters in uh, Haruhi Suzumizo, and I don't know if I have her for any long. I may, but you know for now I got her. She's pretty cool. I like the figurine a lot. I got this in the swap meet, this little Adobe. I traded her for like another little trade figure from Galaxy Railroads. Cause I, I, like, I love G Gundam and that, that was the only thing I wanted from the guy. So yeah. I did trade some other stuff. Like a, I got like some buttons and a Pokemon case thing. But I gave those to my nieces. Cause I didn't need them. And I was, yeah, when I was in swap meet I tried to get rid of as much stuff I wanted. But this was the main thing I got in the swap. Look at this. A D Arts Duke Mon. I did not. I brought her with my legendary my fights belt, don't worry, not like the D fights belt, the legendary rider fights belt. It was cool at the time, but you know, it's, legendary rider belt sucks. <laughs> I gotta say it. But some guy, one guy wanted it for some mangas, but like no, I don't really uh, wanted that. Um, but then there's one guy offered me, if you wait 15 minutes, I could get you this D art Stupon figurine in my room. Would you wait? Like, okay, sure. Like a Pokemon figure, and I, I was thinking either, either it's like the old one or the the D arts, and of course yeah, the D arts one. Like oh hell yeah, I'm like yes yes, I'll trade, I'll trade. <laughs> like that was awesome about it. And then uh, I think got something else. I forgot to bring it. Out. Hold on. It was also in the swamp meat because I traded something else. I did got another manga GTO Volume Two. I right, I don't have Volume One because I got this in a trade. I traded. I wanted my items for this one, so I get, you know, get, at least I got Vine 2 out of the way, please see was free. <laughs> and then I got these five Guilty Crown figurines, they're, they're a lot like Nandroids, because of the big old head and the swirly eyes, but yeah. I originally just got her and him, because those two go, you get her, you gotta at least get him, or if you get him, you gotta get her to get her, but then I pick up this character, because she got the little fang going on, I like the anime char characters, girls with the fang. <laughs> yeah, like, you know what, I might as well complete the set. And if I don't like, when, once I, when I do watch the anime, if I don't like the characters, I'll, I'll just, you know, I'll just bring them in a trade or something. But I'm, I'm keeping these, uh, I'm keeping these two and uh, this girl. I might keep her if I don't, you know, like the character, but I'm pretty sure I will. Alright, this is like the, um, now I'll show you the other stuff I got, the kind of like my, the three main things. Uh, I'll be right back. Well, not three. Not three things, I think it's five, more like four or five, or <laughs> whatever. I lost count, okay, I'll be um, right back with this video. Uh, as I was saying, uh, one of the main things for going to Anime Milwaukee, not just to get my ASIN badge, but also to meet Alex Tipton. She did, she's a voice actress, she um, she does a lot of the main voices of female characters, such as, Musa, you see here, Musubi from Sekirei, Himiji from Baka and Test, so Sunset from My Brides of Mermaid and Mocha from um, Rosario Vamp and many other anime series I can't think of right now, but yeah. It was awesome meeting her. Uh, if you already noticed the video already posted, so if you want to look, check that video. Yeah, I'll put it like in uh, the link in the description bar right here. Got her autograph, this Musubi poster. I remember getting this a little while back and like, oh, I can get her this autograph. <laughs> her reaction to this poster was hilarious too. And she also signed this um, little 
postcard thing, uh, mo mo mocha right there. Like she sat around the butt. <laughs> and then to the and to the other things I got, I also had her autograph this this prize figurine and Himiji or Mizuki right there. She was put right there, Alex Tipton. She she her reaction was awesome. She really liked this a lot. She never seen this before. I even let her. I even told her what side I got it from. And the same thing for this one. She was excited seeing these. Mainly, she was excited seeing those two in the poster. She was really excited. Center right there. So I gotta get another one of this figurine to have to take out the box. This one's pretty beat up though. Me, I'll swipe. I can't even switch out the box. <laughs> but yeah, really awesome. I'm gonna get another one of her to have one again pose. I, I was gonna get one seal, but. Money and time, and you know, I, I, I can't wait. So, you know, and then the main thing this is the first thing I bought at the convention is the Figma Black Rock shooter. I couldn't believe it. I there was three booths I had her one for 65, one for 60, and the last one I went was for 55. Of course, I went with the cheaper one, and I got and I make sure to buy it that day Friday because I know. Cause the next day, when I, uh, next day there was no more Black Rock shooters, they were gone. So I'm glad I bought this one. I'm glad I, you know, this pays to go to the convention on Fridays. Cause you know, you know, you think you get better deals during Saturday or Sunday? No. If you if when the popular stuff are gone, yeah. When the popular stuff are gone, you know, you miss a chance. So I'm glad I picked her up. This is freaking awesome. I have not even figured where I can display her yet. Cause of course I'm gonna display her with the hoodie with the hood on. And uh, with the sword, now I can't. Pull, I, would, I would love to pose her with the gun, but I mean the cannon, but I can't. Cause if you can see, I'm already running out of room on my uh, imports. But yeah, this is pretty cool. My little haul from Anime Milwaukee it was a lot of fun. Got to got to hang out with my boy Feral Black on Saturday. It was a pretty cool, pretty cool experience. Uh, of course, I give I give the I, I give the con five out of five. My I saw my friends. One of my friends, she did. She gave a two point five. She mainly goes just to hang out with friends. I Me, mean, I go to to meet the guests, the dealers' room, the cosplay, all the good stuff. Partying, eh, I'm not much of a partier. I don't, I don't like drinking, but heck, nah, I'm not much of a drinker. I don't drink at all, actually. I'm straight edge. But yeah, man, um, this is my uh, haul from Man in Milwaukee. You guys, I hope you enjoyed. And uh, again, I'm not gonna put. This, um, you're not going to see these in my haul in a month because, you know why, I'm going to reshow them again. <laughs> this be a lot, and plus, a lot, a lot less space, a lot more space for me to pull the other figurines I got this month. Because you can see, because most of them will be in the packaging. Oh, hope you guys enjoyed my haul of the month, uh, haul of the month, my haul from Anime Milwaukee 2013. It was a blast, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So this is wrap 5, I'm going to, and should it go, go. Goodbye. Freaking awesome.